Good morning guys, it's a Monday morning and I'm about to take Daisy for just a little walk and then we are going to go for a hike. I don't know why, I just feel like going for a hike. I feel like checking out the sunrise and yeah, so that's basically what we're going to do. <clears throat> I mean like I'll come back and walk Rosie too, but uh, that's the plan. We're going to go for a, a little cheeky hike and uh, just get some footage of the sunrise. I am doing a full day of eating as well. It is a rest day, but because I'm hiking I might eat a little bit more so I'll probably eat around like 1800 calories something like that and uh, yeah so I'm just gonna do the walking I'll show you what I'm packing and then get going basically all right so what I'll be taking with me is my backpack which has in here uh, a first aid kit which there you go um, I'll take with me some sunnies because if the sun comes up I'll need some sunglasses my wallet because obviously I need to pay for things potentially I've got a bottle of aminos um, and I've got here like I made the oat cake the other day in the other vlog for the for that thing there what's it called now the air fryer but basically what I did is I made four portions and just baked it in the oven in one of these trays for about 45 minutes so I have one and a half portions here I will also take with me a portable charger just in case is this for my phone I think it is a phone plug let's have a look and uh, the reason I'm taking that is just uh, because of the fact that I will need to sat nav there and I want to run like a tracking, a walking app just to see how much I'm walking and how long it takes me and stuff like that. I will also go to the petrol station to get a, a small bottle of water. I want to get a coffee. Um, I need to take one of these with me to keep in the car for when I get a coffee whenever I'm in the car. Otherwise, I'm going to have several layers on, some uh, a, a head, uh, a hat with a headlight and I've got a light for Daisy around her neck as well I'll buy some chewing gum, I'll get some water, some water for Daisy and I've got one of these little sachets left over as well so I'll take one of these for her too she's eating now which will have digested by the time we get to the walk but just want to make sure that um, you know she does have some food in case we go hungry and then I think we're gonna go because I want to just make sure that I catch all of the sunrise basically I'm super excited so I'll take my camera, but I'll probably do a lot of vlogging on my phone, but, you know, um, I'll be able to transfer the files. It is five past seven, and we, we arrived at the destination, so I'm gonna... Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. I'm gonna get my bag ready, put on the stuff, and let's get hiking. I'm so excited. I don't even know why, but I'm really looking forward to it. only literally like 10 minutes into this hike but fucking hell I am so happy I decided to do this I don't know what it is but I mean look at this view look at that I don't know what it is about just like walking and being in nature but it just genuinely brings me like legit happiness and there's also uh, is this where I'm supposed to go mm. I think so. Oh, maybe not. Maybe I am. Oh well. At least it's cold. So uh, the mud is hard. And I'm wearing hiking boots. So it's fine. But Daisy! Daisy! Oh, there she is. I've got her like a, look. Got her like a little, um, like you you. You feel you feel lamps? There she is. Trouble. Go on. Uh, 
really I can't wait to have Rosa heels so she can do this too but anyway as I was saying I don't know what it is but there's just something about being in nature and watching sunrises I don't know it's just fucking magical isn't it like there's not to be like soppy or anything like that but I'm so happy like in a way I am grateful and happy I can do things like that that I have the physical capabilities I suppose I have the means by transport that I have the urge to drive can you imagine there's so many people that just live life and they just don't get to do things like this because they don't want to because they'd rather stay at home like uh, I went to bed about 12 o'clock last night because I went out for dinner I had four hours of sleep uh, 11, 12, something like that I fed around four hours of sleep but how can you be tired in an environment like this you know I'll be fucked later but yeah I'm really happy with this alright the sun's like starting to get properly up now so I don't have to worry about her her collar thing anymore Daisy Ooh, almost falling over Daisy come here Come here. Wait. Stay. Stay, Daisy. Come here. You don't need this anymore. Okay, let's turn it off. Okay. Go on, lunatic. Let me actually I'm watching the sunrise. Actually seeing the sun come up. Wow. progress though. Stay up there. Let me show you what I can see. It's really nice. I've got Sophia down there. I've got a little Daisy. Hey Trouble! We saw uh, like a Capricorn or something like that. Uh, just up there. She almost ran after her. After it. I managed to stop her though because it's kind of like rocky and Obviously, I don't want her to hurt herself, so I managed to put her on the lead, it's fine. Anyway, let's get to the top of these because I'm fucking starving. <laughs> well, we made it to the top, guys. I'm not going to stay here because it's kind of like a windy nook. I've got a little daisy back there, but hold on, let me show you. Hold on, let, let me show you Sophia. Look at that. But now it's definitely time to eat because I'm freaking starving. Alright, guys, so. So we've got to the top. I'm gonna this is one and a half portions of my pumpkin oat bake. Uh, it's in the previous vlog, so if you want to know the recipe, it's there. Um I can complete that one, it's really easy to make. 
And I also put in here around two tablespoons of uh, almond butter. We walked for about an hour, a little bit more than an hour, because obviously I stopped to take pictures and stuff. I think the dog was some water holder. Which makes about sense, it's about five kilometers. So now, now the descent begins. But that'll go quick. So, do you want some yummy? Do you want to try some yummy oat bake? So good, this. Probably one of the favourite things I've ever made. It tastes like cake. Anyway, I'm so glad I've done this. Really. It's been uh I'm gonna be fucked later. I was meant to get food shopping, but to be honest, I don't know if I can bother it. I didn't take my bags with me either. And I don't want to keep getting plastic bags, so maybe I'll just try and fix whatever I have at home with whatever I have at home. I do know is, is that I wish I had a nice cup of warm tea. I think a warm shower and a cup of tea is one of the first things I'll do when I get home. Hmm. Right. Mm -mm. I'll finish this and let's start the descent. Well, as you can tell, I came back. I've had a shower. I did some work, and uh, I was quite hungry, so I've I've eaten food. <laughs> I forgot I was filming today. Basically, what I had here was 50 grams of cream of rice with 100 grams of pineapple and 30 grams of whey protein. So I'm going to eat this, and then, as you can tell, I'm looking very tired. I've got a spot here as well, and the spot there, so I've got one of those patches on it. But I feel very tired after that hike, so I'm actually going to have a nap. The doggies are sleeping quite well, so. Normally I walked him around 12, but um, I'm sure they'll be fine till about 11. Look, she's literally completely wiped out. I've never seen her so tired in my life. <laughs> Bless her. She's just permanently sleeping. Poor thing. And then this trouble over here. Violet. Violet. Hey, Pissy. Toilet. <laughs> Where it goes. Excuse me. What is that noise? <laughs> what is that noise? What, what are you talking about? Huh? <laughs> I'll show you why she's talking like that because basically I am too freaking tired to cook, guys. So I got takeout. So this is a pretty healthy takeout. I got some chicken soup because I really fancy some soup. I got a cabbage and like I got carrot salad here. I got a cabbage salad there. I got some lutinetta. I got a little bit of uh, stajenka salad, which is yogurt with cucumber. This is basically like tomatoes and stuff like that. I got grilled corn. I don't know. I just really fancied it. And here I have um, chicken, and I have like a um, a veal patty. So I'll probably make like a sandwich or something like that. But first, I'm not actually... This is what I'll probably eat throughout the rest of the day. 
if even all of this to be honest but what i'll definitely eat now is i will eat the, the corn on the cob with a little bit of butter and salt and i'm gonna have some of the soup and uh, i might have a little bit of the salad actually because that looks quite nice but i'm not really um uh, i don't know i'm just not i just i am like look just look how tired i look i'm absolutely completely wiped out from just from that walk so uh i'm just gonna have a little bit of food whilst i'm doing some work and then whatever's left over is left over. I can do a pot taste this. Let's do a taste this. So let's try this first. This is well good. It's chicken leg. It's a little fatty, but I don't know, I just feel like I need the fats to be honest. So I'm taste this of this one here. This is veal, but that's definitely gonna go in the burger, in the in the, in the bread there. Oh my god. That is so tasty. It's like a burger but better. That's gonna go in here with the salad, with the lutinetza. Anyway, I'm gonna have that soup, have that, and have some salad basically. So I'm not gonna film it because I'm working. I've got quite a lot of things to do. I need to finish editing a video, and uh, I'll be back when I'm. I'm gonna prepare this later. So stay tuned for that. So it turns out that I'm actually a lot hungrier than I thought I was. I've absolutely annihilated one of these uh, chicken legs or chicken thighs. I'm gonna finish this other one now, and then I'll put my little patty together for later. Uh, I'm gonna finish eating this cabbage as well. This cabbage salad is very nice actually. I like cabbage salads. It's like a, it's kind of like a sauerkraut, but I like it because I find that uh, this sort of salty sort of cabbage salads they always they're very good for my digestion. Um, which, by the way, my digestion. You know how I've always had issues with this. Not always, but when I'm prepping, I have big issues with it. I've been eating a bit more oats, and that's made a huge difference. So maybe it was just a bit too much rice or something. I don't know. I've put a bit of barbecue sauce in here. I'm gonna take this behind the computer and eat it. And then, um, then I will have this as a last meal. Mm, I don't know, maybe, what time is it now? It's like 4 o'clock now. I'll probably have that around like 6, six or 7 before I walk the dogs. Help with the digestion. And um, yeah, that will be a full day of eating. I've actually stuck everything into my fitness pal. From, from what I could, because obviously you can only do so much. And um, so for all of this, this full day of eating is going to come down to around 1800 calories. I have... Um, put it in as tzatziki, which is this, this Najenka salad, it's basically like a tzatziki. Four tablespoons. I've got two, um, I've got eight ounces of chicken thigh meat from the Mongolian grill, it looks about right. I've got two tablespoons of the home homemade lutinetsa. I've got a veal burger, which is one at 150 grams, that will be around 150 grams. Uh, I've got a pita, which I know this isn't pita, but it, it kind of is like a pita bread. I've got four ounces of chicken soup because there wasn't really anything in that soup. It was mostly just stock with like a little bit of chicken. And then I've got four cups of coleslaw. So I reckon that sounds about right. Um, so all in all, all of this food together is around a thousand calories. But obviously I've eaten other food throughout the day too. If I'm hungry later still, I might eat a bit more because I feel like I, I had, I did have three leg days in a row over the weekend as well as this hike this morning, which would have burned a lot of um calories i mean like i'm on 18,000 already which isn't it's not just the steps because i do, i get to up to 18 to 20,000 steps quite regularly but i think it's just the hiking the weather the uphill walking is obviously a lot harder so anyway i'm gonna eat this do some more work and then i have my live stream in an hour and then i can find you chill and relax the best for last. Oh, I'm so full up now as well. But oh, I've been fucking starving today. Yes. I've been really hungry today after our walk this morning. Very hungry after our walk this morning. And soon, well not soon, maybe next year you can come for a walk with us too, pretty girl. So pretty you are. Such a pretty girl you are. Yeah. The ears. Hey, excuse me. Excuse me. How do you have so much energy? How do you have so much energy? You walked 
twice as much as me running around mm. and going hunting. How do you have so much energy, huh? Huh? You want attention too? That was delicious. Like, really nice. Very salty though. But I'm sure I can do with the salts, to be honest. Uh, I'm just out of curiosity, I wonder how many calories I would have um, burned. Allegedly, as per this hike. So I found this thing online where you put in the distance, the elevation, um, the weight of your backpack and your weight, and it calculates like roughly how many calories you would have burned. And uh, it reckons I would have burned around like 1100, 1200 calories, which sounds about right to be honest, because I was starving by the time I got to that peak. And obviously it's not the same as just taking steps because of the elevation and carrying, because I had two liters of water, food, as well as the water on my front, so I, I had, hello, yes, 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 I had at least, I had at least three, three kilos on me in terms of like carrying things, so, hey. Excuse me, what do you have to say? What do you have to say? Huh? Fatty? Big girl? She's not fat though, like I call her fatty because she's heavy, but she's not fat. When you see her, she's really streamlined. She's just very buff because she walks a lot, this little girl. She must have done at least twice as the same distance as me. Up and down, running, hunting, all the time. Anyway, I don't know if I'll eat anything else. I might do, I might not. Um, I feel like if I need to eat, I will because of the sheer, like, like I said, I had three leg days in a row as well as doing this hike today. And my body feels tough, but as it is, um, I'm sitting at around 1800 calories, which is good so far. This was very filling, so I'm not sure yet. Maybe I'll make like, a little anabolic ice cream or something like that later, just something sweet, but not so many calories. Maybe I'll do that, a little anabolic ice cream. But I don't know yet. I feel pretty full up right now, so that was really good. I really enjoy that. Anyway, I'm going to continue watching the YouTube underground. I'll lay down with my legs up and tonight I'll take some extra magnesium and some extra glucosamine just for recovery that is the plan all right so I am starving still and I have a raging headache too so I'm gonna eat some more food I'm gonna make an anabolic ice cream because a that will be filling and b it won't be so many calories and I feel like I definitely need to eat protein it's one of those things, if you don't eat, if you eat a lot of protein, you kind of feel like you need to eat some more. And I feel like I need to eat some more. And I need to hang my washing up, so I'm going to hang up my washing whilst my anabolic ice cream is uh, blending. So what I'm going to do is around 200 grams of frozen strawberries, 20 grams of whey protein, 100 milliliters of egg whites, because I don't want a full big serving, and ice cubes and xanthan gum, and I'll blitz that up. That will be my uh, sort of desserty thing. Basically, fuck this headache. I'm gonna go to bed early as well. It's like quarter past seven. I'll be definitely. I'll be getting ready for bed by eight, and I'll be in bed before eight thirty. All right, guys. So here is the anabolic ice cream. I feel like I might be getting a little bit sick. <coughs> I'm coughing up chunky bits. So let's hope that's not gonna happen. Um, otherwise, insert a sunrise emoji because we saw the sunrise today, and that's it. I'm gonna eat this and go to bed. Because I'm super tired and I want to catch up on the sleep from yesterday. So, thanks a lot for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, dislike the video if you dislike it. Let me know down below why. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Oh, and in terms of like the amount of calories I've eaten today, it's going to be around 2000. I haven't put this in. Before I put this in, it was around 17, 1800. This will make it around 2000. I think 180 carbs, 180 protein, and around 70 fat. So my fat was a bit higher than usual, but I'm okay with that. Because I feel like I burnt a lot. Hmm. And average as well earlier. I don't know if I like this here, but I feel like I'm actually looking quite lean today. So I'm okay with it. <laughs>